What's going on guys? Welcome back to a video. You probably recognize this area right here, right? See it? A little, little circle for you guys. Rammer, you see it? I'll make you a little dizzy, but so as you guys know, this thing is pretty much Ryan, D Max Rhino. If you guys are following, go follow him, D Max Rhino, and workfortapparel.com. If you guys go to workfortapparel.com, go buy a t-shirt, go buy anything, and it enters you into winning this truck. Now for you guys that watch me and Ryan's channel already, I don't know if he's told you much about it. So I just drove this right now. We had to go pick it up. He got all detailed and cleaned. And this truck is amazing. Like this thing makes me want to go back to Duramax. Kind of like sort of just because, I mean, the power, I mean, this thing, no joke, feels faster than my 19 Ram. Now, you know, I, I don't know, but they, it just, this is a nice truck. So it's weird. I can't explain it, but if four of you guys are going to win it you are going to be lucky i told ryan you sure like can you throw another truck i'll buy this thing off you but he's giving this thing away guys now i don't know if he has showed you close-ups like on this truck like a lot of times the bumper is like destroyed you know rock chips i mean there's nothing that's a bug that i just did right now but i mean this paint is so pristine the lights, the tires, I mean, the rims. Look at these red rims. I mean, this is crazy how nice this truck is, and he's giving it away. I'm like, like, I don't know if you guys know, the guy drives this thing in, like, another OBS. No offense to the OBS people out there, but, like, dude, I just drove in that thing, and, oh, my gosh, it's just disgusting, horrible. So he's giving this thing away. I mean, it's got, a, you get a free screwdriver right there and you guys he's got it already bed liner so he's got the, um this part this is just the plastic but he does have like the linex or rhino lining on this thing uh, it's got everything pretty much freshly painted lights and it's got uh the front lights aftermarket i'm not sure i assume so he probably has airbags in this thing uh i would assume that there's airbags and let's take a peek i don't uh yeah look at that so you get airbags right there what's the, the most amazing thing about this oh and if you're wondering why my truck and trailer is here well you'll see stay tuned but sergio's doing some work over there i'll have him explain to you guys and i think it's done but you get a brand new key fob from boost auto shout out to boost auto and it works but look at the interior so usually on these trucks you guys know is the door panels you know this will start coming apart this will start coming apart headliner starts tearing and ripping i don't know what ryan bought this thing for but this is a nice truck. I mean, look at the seats. Look at this. Look at these seats. I mean, the interior of this thing is flawless. And I'm not, you know, like I said, I'm not trying to sell you the truck. You can win this truck. That's crazy. Like, this is a nice truck, guys. It's got, it's got, oh yeah, it's got Apple CarPlay. I was using my phone. I mean, look at this thing. This is a nice truck. So if you guys want this, uh, well, you can win it. I mean, it's, it's like, to me, honestly, it's like, literally oh, almost perfect dang condition i mean and I, I i wouldn't say really a con you know I, I can't tell you what's the con and i'm obviously i'm not calling it perfect condition because i mean obviously it's not perfect you know you're not going to uh get a truck like this very rare it's gonna be perfect and what i mean by not perfect is like you know minor stuff like this like you see this minor stuff but I would say I would give this truck a 99, you know, percent, literally almost, I mean, pristine because it is, I mean, there's, there's no dings, no dents, no rock chips. Usually when you win something or if someone's given something away, there's always like a catch. I think, I don't know. Uh, maybe there's not, you know, I have, I personally know someone that's won a truck and he likes it, you know, but he's like, it's got 400,000 miles on it. He had to do a bunch of stuff on it. I'm not naming anything. I'm not going to say when, where, how and all that, but this thing's hardly got any my 160k i think it said on there but i mean this is a nice truck guys i don't know i don't know why ryan's doing it i'd give this thing away i mean if anything i, I don't know why he'd want to give that thing away that thing is like in pristine condition but he wants to give that thing away and then you know we're here what up zach What's going on, buddy? how you doing brother doing all right. and we're here i don't know if ryan you shows you guys hey how you doing Whoa, cheers. Touch GoPro. Cheers. 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 hold on <laughs> But yeah, I'll explain to you guys why we're here and, and what I, I I need this bad boy. That's the main reason why I came here. And then I'll show you uh, what Sergio did to the truck. And I'm not sure if I'm allowed to show you guys what's going on over there and over here. So I'm gonna stay over here until we figure out what you know I can 
fully show you guys because I don't want to like ruin the video for, for Ryan that he's going to post. All right. I know there's snacks in here somewhere. What? What is? Oh, no, no snacks there. No snacks there. Where? I know they. Oh, here we go. Dean. Oh, what do you guys think? Pringles? Funyuns? I think I'm going to go. Let's see. The blue bag of Doritos is my favorite. But I don't know if there's. Oh, oh. Okay, ruffles. Let's see. What else we got? Jalapeno. Spicy. No. Sweet spice. Dude, you got anything that's not spicy in this thing? Come on. Eat nut. Okay, honey barbecue. Alright, what else? Pringles. There's gotta be like more. Where's like the chocolate? No. There's gotta be something. Alright, here we go. We're getting somewhere now. We got some apple cider vinegar, Starburst. Yo, Rhino, you're running low on snacks, dude. Let's see. What do we got in here? We got... Okay. Bang. I don't want to bang. Oh, not interested in there. All right. Now we're talking, dude. Now we are talking. Let's go. Let's actually... Yeah, you know, these are really good. All right. Because I like the three-pack, so we're going we're gonna to do this because it's a, it's a three-pack, so... All right, I'm sure there's more, but I'm not I'm not sure where he hides his stuff around here. So we're going to start off with the chips. And, um, well, we'll be back after these messages. If you guys want any Port Ford apparel, extra large for the big boys. Oh, there's, there's a lot of goodies in here, guys. All right, guys, so the main, well, not the main reason. One of the reasons why I'm here is because I need Ryan's Mini X. He's not letting it uh, load up right now. And the other reason uh, we're here, we're stopped by to see Sergio because Sergio does some stuff to the truck. What's up, man? What up, Sergio? So, what I did, guys, is, you guys know, I already had these Baja Design lights right here that they sent me, and um, the front one that they sent me up here, the 20, I believe it's a 20 inch, right here. And I've always wanted them to flash, but I, I didn't know, you know, I figured maybe I could put an LED flasher. I don't know. I'm not, you know, I don't know too much about that. So, Ryan's like, well, dude, just hit up Sergio. And I'm like, well, shit, why? It's, that's a great idea. Why haven't I hit up Sergio? That's what he does. So, Sergio said he could take care of it for me. And I think it's done, right? Yeah, it's done. Okay, Got so. Oh, where's the key? The key? Oh, yeah, there you go. So, uh, as you guys know, I got the auxiliary switches in here. Now, now they still stay, like, stationary yes. on the three and the four? Yeah, with the flasher that we install, yeah, you can have up to three modes. Okay. One switch per mode, and you can have one to be steady on, the other one to be flashing, and the other one to be fast and flashing. Perfect. Okay. So, so, what did you do? So, we kept this switch, I think you told me it was four, to be steady on, right? Yeah, four, or num number three is the back steady on, and number four is the... No, but four is the back steady on. And three is and the, the front, front yeah. steady on. So okay. Right now, there should be on and steady they are yeah right now they're on yeah steady on there you go oh sh oh damn that's badass look at that guys hell yeah Shit, that's awesome that's perfect yeah and i wanted this guys because you never know sometimes i mean it's just especially in the desert you're in the middle of nowhere and it's like you need to attract so much attention so they don't smash into you you know that's the problem with the lights when they're just steady. Need some amber flush. We'll amber? Yeah. Okay, yeah, we can do that. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Perfect, perfect. And then um, the front, what does the front one do? The front. Yeah, can you make that one flash or no? Yeah, we can do that. Um, I need to play a little bit with it to see okay. if we can use the same flasher for both because you need them to be separate. And like, if you wear like all together on steady on, then yeah, we can use definitely the same flasher okay because you want to sometimes use only the front or the rear one then okay okay you might need to use another flash okay but yeah as many flashers as you want you can make whatever lights you want. okay so to turn to make down flash is it what was it auxiliary five. number five. five okay perfect so four for steady on rear and then five to make them flash if you have perfect. them both it will prioritize the flashing so you can prioritize if you have oh both, okay okay on, okay to do no but if you just want to add the flash you just push you number four five, yeah. okay and now if we were to add another flasher up here can this one like can you use like the number six to make it flash or if you use number four can you, or we can use the same one we can use number five five for all flash lights 
Okay. Yeah, that's still housed separately from study on and the rear study on just different switches. Okay. For, so we would just need another LED flasher. Correct. Okay. Okay. And where do you uh, where do you install that LED flasher? Oh, look at that. Bam. There you go, guys. Well, we put it right here so you can still open the fuse. The fuse? Okay. Perfect. Um, Perfect. Yeah, you will see Excellent. Here, if, we, if I turn it on, you will see here the lights flashing. And now they, they automatically change, right? Like, you don't. Okay, perfect. So I don't have a button. I, that's one thing, guys. I don't want to deal with the button. Just change automatically. Oh, there you go. Oh, look at that. Shit, so that's it awesome. has different patterns. You can go something slower or faster. It does it automatically, all the pattern, right now, or? Right now, it goes between two patterns, slow and fast. Okay. There's another one that goes like four different patterns by itself. That's a different flasher, yeah, or? Different, okay. different, the same flasher, but you have to change the pattern that you want. You will see here that you have pattern um, input. So this one, you put ground for one second, and uh, it will switch the pattern. Okay, okay. And also, it will go through, I think, 10 different patterns, and then steady on. Okay. And then the break steady on, which do three fast flashing and then stay steady on. Okay. Then you stop, stop style. I will call. Yeah, I'm just using it for the desert when yeah. I go to the desert. So that's, that's another it. option. Uh, okay. You can have two more outputs for two more lights if you want. So that's what I'm wondering: is can we use? Can we make this front one flash with the same flasher or no? Yes. The only thing is again um, because you want to have steady on separately. Yes. Uh, I have to think. The it's easier to just put another flasher yes. basically okay yeah. All right. it is doable but we have to work around where you have to use diodes because um if not then the current from one light bar when you have a steady on will jump into the other one and no so okay have to okay think okay. about it a little bit more we might be able to use the same one but just need to uh, draw the schematics and see how we can do it okay um the easier way would be to put another flasher if you want yeah okay yeah uh, maybe i think we'll do that just throw another one and then we can hook this to the number six correct so because i'm not going to use them for anything else all right you, you know okay yeah. perfect uh, all so right there we go all right guys so now we have to bust this thing open because i need to take this thing to my house real quick because rhino has to uh, do some work because i got you guys know the big massive logs and i cannot move them without that thing and that thing's got a thumb to be able to pretty much grab it and pick it up well guys we are finally done super stoked big thank you to ryan aka dmx rhino for let me use this bad boy right here because well as you guys know without this thing i couldn't have got all those massive logs down there up and off the floor out of the way the problem that i had i don't know if i told you guys but with uh, the cat, Spencer's cat, it was great, same thing, but it doesn't have a thumb, so we could not pick it up and set them where we go. So, big thanks to Rhino. We gotta go take it back now to the Rhino Ranch, because I'm sure he's missing it. Well, boys, that's a wrap. Huge shout out to Rhino for letting me use that big Mini X. Uh, a lot of you guys, you know, I'm not, I don't know if you know, but those things are expensive to run. You know, those machines are not cheap. Uh, just to you know the, the little amount of time that we ran it and just in the and fuel and greasing everything you know wear and tear on tracks and stuff like that so uh, appreciate it rhino thank you sir but that's all i got for you guys today if you guys like this video don't forget to hit that thumbs up button or click subscribe peace yeah